Now Katie joins us with a look at our full forecast. Yeah, well, we're tracking some rain today. We're still seeing some rain throughout the evening, really starting to pick up overnight tonight. But the good news is it is just rain. That story might change later on in the week. But if you do have any plans late tonight, maybe early tomorrow morning when this is still lingering, I think all you really need is just those windshield wipers. Most of southern Illinois is looking pretty dry right now. Just a few isolated showers, especially near the Harrisburg area. Switching over to western Kentucky, though, seeing a bit more rain, some of those heavier pockets, but still not seeing anything too serious. And I am seeing any lightning returns on this. Here's the bulk of the heavier rain over parts of SEMO into western Kentucky near the Union City Martin area. But again, it's really just some scattered showers that we're tracking pretty large system. We have this low pressure just to our north behind that much cooler air. So they're not seeing rain. They're really getting that snow and then the cold front extended off of it. That's going to push through the region tomorrow. But because of this pretty large system, a couple watches, warnings and advisories are in place, not for our region, but just to our north parts of the state are seeing that winter weather advisory. We're kind of flirting with the possibility of that advisory for tomorrow, but right now really not seeing that for us, but very cold temperatures are going to fill in behind this cold front. St. Louis near 50 degrees, but Kansas City in those mid 20s, and that's pretty much what we're watching for tomorrow. Pretty mild tonight. This is unseasonably warm for our highs this time of year much less what we're seeing at 10 o'clock at night. We're somewhere in those mid 40s and in a couple of hours staying in those 40s, even close to upper 40s by tomorrow morning. And that's going to be tomorrow's highs because once that cold front pushes through, we're tracking some much colder air. But for tonight, just scattered showers, mild temperatures for Sunday. Some of that rain lingering into the first half of the day, much cooler air filling in behind it. And then next week, Really the big story. It's going to be colder and we have a couple chances of possibly some wintry mix. But here's what we're looking at right now. Still those scattered showers as the system gets closer to us. Cold front approaching from the west early tomorrow morning if you do have to get out pretty early. But those showers clear out of here pretty quickly by lunchtime. A couple of isolated showers. Then we see that cold air by 6 o'clock into the upper 30s. Still maybe some rain on the back end of this, possibly some ice as well. So something to really watch, especially as you're getting out early Monday morning, we could see those bridges, overpasses, freeze, maybe a couple of slippery roadways. So just take caution of that. But still waking up Monday morning or getting out mid-morning, we're going to be in the upper 20s, low 30s. So we have some cold air coming in, but we're still tracking that rain at least for today. The first chance of maybe that wintry mix the first round being tomorrow night into Monday morning, the second chance into Monday night. So we're really going to want the storm track three up, especially if we do get an advisory or anything out of any of these systems because it's a couple rounds of it. We have those showers for today, the winter weather chance for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, maybe even Thursday. It's teetering with rain. Still a couple of days out, something to watch but a pretty active seven day as far as the winter weather goes. So we've got that chance of rain lingering into tomorrow morning, possibly a wintry mix into early Monday. So just take caution as you're heading out early. A couple more rounds of that as well. So you're going to want to stay with us. It's a couple of days out, but something you're really going to want to keep an eye on. Yeah, especially when we just cleared out some of this winter weather, mm -hmm. right? I mean, we just got rid of some of that snow. Nice to finally see it melting, but now we're going to see it melt again and with some more slick conditions on the way. Yeah, I'm ready for spring. Oh my gosh, me too. Well, still ahead.